as Eckhart Tolle says, your deepest identity is in stillness. But what happens is we get so busy with the noise of life that we lose that identity and we start looking outside of ourselves and into the world to find who we are or find that happiness. So by creating more stillness in your life and finding that still, stillness within, we actually find ourselves more. And that sounds all very deep and meaningful and that's because it probably is. But if we can be comfortable in stillness, we actually become more comfortable within ourselves, which ideally gives us more confidence, self-esteem and other just well-being factors. Now, the breathing technique. Before I start teaching you the breathing technique, it's probably important for me to confess that when I worked like a mad woman doing 12 hour days, seven days a week, um, I hated breathing techniques. I hated having to breathe properly because I didn't have time for breathing. It was ridiculous. Seriously, breath is life. And in theory, what I was saying to myself was no to life. And yeah, that didn't work out that well for me anyway, because when I burnt out, I had to take some time out to find stillness. And that all worked out perfectly because now here I am teaching stillness. So let's talk about the breathing technique. It's very simple. First of all, find somewhere that you can sit and not be disturbed. And what I want you to do is sit, not lie down, because it's too easy to fall asleep if you're exhausted. And we need to sit up straight with our spine straight. So what that means is pelvis forward, tummy in, chest open, shoulders back, and head upright. And you can have your arms wherever is most comfortable. And the first thing to do is just, you can do this with your eyes closed or open. I think having them closed makes it easier to concentrate. So first of all, Push your tummy out, just make a big round belly by breathing in all the goodness. And when you breathe out, take your time and just slowly pull the tummy back in. And then push it out to make that inhale again. And when you inhale, Visualize a brilliant, vibrant, white light going all the way up your spine. And then when you exhale, visualize that light being dispersed in all directions of your spine. And as you breathe out, think of the word, ah. So you can do this out loud if it helps you to start with. But I'll give you an example. Breathe in first. And then out. And then in. And alongside that ah which actually feels quite relieving in itself. Think of letting go, letting go of the ship from the day, letting go of the past, just that's ridding the old. Everything that does not serve you anymore comes out with that exhale. And then when you breathe in, making a big rounded belly, look at it go. <laughs> and then in again, breathe in the newness, breathe in the love. And if you're concentrating on the breath and this visualization, it makes it a lot harder for your mind to wander. So you literally have to focus on the breath and the visualization and you create stillness. It's very, very simple. And it actually takes practice. And don't worry if you don't get it right the first time or even the 21st time, because as long as you're sitting there with the intention to be with yourself and be comfortable in that stillness. It just gets easier over time. And then some days it's not. Some days it's a struggle to even sit still, even after years of doing breathing techniques, because life is life and it does get in the way sometimes. Give it a go, guys. And I look forward to hearing if you can do that every day for the next two weeks. That would be a great test to see if it actually makes a difference in your world. So that's all about finding stillness, the first act in your self-love practice.
Thanks for watching, guys. Cheers!